welcome back today in this video we will see i learn types of adjectives then so let's start in our last video we have seen that what adjective means so in that video i have already told you that there are basically two adjectives one is descriptive and other one is determiner adjective the first one is adjective of quality these adjectives show the kind or quality of a person or a thing actually we can check by asking the question of what kind adjective of quality answers the question of what kind like he is an honest man i can make a question like what kind of a man he is he is an honest man so honest is adjective of quality the foolish old crow tried to sing what kind of crow the foolish one so foolish is adjective of quality this is grammar of the english language here again english is a proper noun and adjective is made of it so the word english is representing adjective of quality here adjectives formed from the proper nouns are called proper adjectives and they are generally classified classed with adjectives of quality like turkish tobacco indian tea english language etc coming to the second adjective that is adjective of quantity as the name suggests adjective of quantity show how much of a thing is meat like i ate some rice here some is representing quantity he has little intelligence he did not eat any rice here the word is some little and any are showing a quantity hence they are adjectives of quantity to check if the adjective or quantity is there or not we can question like how much so how much rice i ate i ate some rice so we can check by using this question that if the adjective of quantity is there or not number 3 that is adjective of number adjective of number show how many persons or things means we are talking about the number adjective of number are further subdivided into definite and indefinite actually in definite numerical adjective we denote an exact number but in indefinite numerical adjective we do not denote an exact number like the indefinite numerical adjectives words like 1 2 3 or first second third etc are there the words 1 2 3 are called cardinals and first second and third are called ordinals indefinite numerical adjectives do not denote an exact number words like all some several and few are used adjective of number answers the question how many like how many apples how many mangoes two mangoes right so the fourth one is distributive adjective distributive distributive adjective refer to each one of a number see these examples each boy must take his turn means i am talking about the every boy present in the class like every every word of it is false means every single word neither accusation is true means N- not a single one the next adjective is demonstrative adjective demonstrative adjective actually point out which person or thing is meant like this boy is stronger than hari 
here i am pointing out this boy those boys must be finished means i am talking about some particular boy i hate such things so these words like this those and such are representing demonstrative adjectives demonstrative adjective answer the question which like which boy is stronger than hari this boy is stronger than hari the words this and that are used with singular nouns and these and those with plural nouns next adjective is interrogative adjectives what which whose when they are used with nouns to ask questions they are called interrogative adjectives we use question mark with them like which way shall shall we go i am making a question here whose book is this so these words are used as interrogative adjectives next one is possessive adjectives possessive adjectives shows the belongingness or the ownership like it is my book here i am talking about my sorry the word my is showing the possessiveness here this is our bag the word my and our are used to show the possessive adjectives the next adjective is emphatic adjectives these adjectives are used to create strong impact of something like i see it with my own eyes here the word own is pressurizing and creating a strong impact similarly he is his own master this is the very thing we want means these words are used to create a pressure on something such adjectives are called emphatic adjectives the last adjectives we are going to study is exclamatory adjectives they are very easy to understand and used with exclamation mark so become easy to judge or to examine whether the adjective is exclamatory or not see the examples what folly or what an idea what a blessing all these adjectives are exclamatory adjectives so the, these were the adjectives and the types i hope they are clear now till the next session keep learning keep watching